Shit, man, you're going to the Olympics. Look at me, dude. Did you think this was going to happen? Well, no, man. You keep saying, you know, I was snowboarding for fun. I didn't really care about the Olympics. Now the Olympics are happening. It's going to be a blast, man. Yeah, it's going to be a blast. So what do you think? What are you going to do now to get ready? Uh, Just shred. Shred? Yeah, where are you going to shred at? I don't know. I'm going to go to X Games next. Then maybe take J-Town somewhere and yeah. go learn maybe another trick or something. And can't wait to see you. Try to do good. Thanks, man. Cool. Congrats again. Thank you. Kaylin, you just made the Olympics. Couldn't be happier. <laughs> it's on. It's official, apparently. <laughs> so they told me, I think. Did you think you'd be making the Olympics? You know, I thought I might have had to rob somebody for the jacket, but I made it. <laughs> How's it feel to wear? Does it feel nice? Yeah, it feels really nice. I'm actually pretty hyped on it, especially with the flag in the hand. So now that there's no more pressure in these contests except to win, like you, know, you don't have to make a team or anything anymore, how's it feel? I'm just so happy today is over, especially because it's been so stressful these last five, six contests, if we count Breck, so it's been so good. you still have to fly out of here at 6 at night tonight? Yep, 521 is my flight. Wow, that's if sick. I make it. Yeah. <laughs> well, congratulations. Thank you. Ariel, you did it. You have the coat. You made the team. What's going through your mind right now? You know, I I'm, think I'm still kind of in shock a little bit. I, Yeah, it hasn't quite set in that I'm going to the Olympics, but I think it will pretty soon. How crazy is it that you and your brother are both going? It's insane. I mean, coming into the season, we both had the same goals, just wanted to land rounds and be consistent. Yeah. And we both did that, and the fact that we're both going to the Olympics together is pretty unreal. Do you think you guys are going to sit next to each other on the flight? Uh, you know, we'll probably we'll probably sit apart from each other, but you know, we'll be we'll be hanging around each other a little bit, I would hope. Cool. So now that the pressure's <laughs> gone, are you feeling like what's going how are you, what are you feeling? I'm just excited to get over there and, and enjoy the entire experience. I mean, I'm excited to go to X Games and just be able to have a contest where the pressure's kind of off. I can just go shred and have fun and, um, yeah, just want to ride well there and then go enjoy the experience as much as I can. Cool. Well, congratulations. You made the Olympics again. Yeah, I did. How, uh, how's, is this one more exciting? Um, I think it's more exciting. No, I'm a little scared to go over to Russia. But I think it's going to be a really good time. Yeah, I think so too. So you were the only guy so far to beat Sean White, right? This year? This year, yeah. So you could probably feel pretty good about that going in the Olympics. I definitely feel pretty good about that. The other, the last one to do that was Danny. Yeah. And we're both going, oh, so yeah. it'll be a good time. So what are you going to do now up until Russia? Uh, X Games next week, and then um, hopefully come home and just unwind for a couple days. And here's home, right, man? Yep, Mammoth. So it probably felt pretty good to win in front of, or to make a team in front of friends, family, all that. For sure, you know, um, being named to the Olympic team is one thing, but doing it in front of your hometown is, it's even more, you know. So? So. You made the Olympics again. So, here we go again. Third time, Olympics. What? Are you as excited for this one as you were for Italy and, what, <sighs> Vancouver? Yes. Yes. I'm very excited. Um... You know, I haven't booked my flight yet, but I'm going to get on that and bring a lot of food because I'm super picky and I hear the, you know, the Olympic Village doesn't have the best selection. So let's talk about this weekend was a big weekend for you. It was. It wasn't like you weren't going to make the team no. unless this weekend happened. Nope. I was in the pressure cooker. Yeah. Uh, I did that last time and sometimes it's the way to go, I guess, because nobody bothers you until yeah. <laughs> you make it so i was just had so much freedom and now you know now it's gonna be crazy oh well look forward to seeing you next year are you gonna be there no i won't be there but oh, too bad. unfortunately well maybe you can go in my suitcase next year yeah huh? let's do it yeah. probably fit yeah, yeah. okay probably cool. cool thanks <laughs> so taylor the coat's off but you own the coat it's really hot in this room so it must feel pretty good to not be wearing that coat finally yeah so now that the whole summer, half the winter, all the training. Do you feel like it's paid off? It's definitely paid off. I mean, I'm really stoked to be going. I'm more stoked on how I'm riding, so yeah. really excited to go to X Games, too. I mean, I wanted to do X Games for 
my entire life. So I think that's your first one that's coming out. Yeah, first one in Aspen. I did France last year, but Aspen I think is a little bit different deal. Your sister's in the event. That's pretty crazy. Did you like? Did you guys ever think growing up that you'd both be Olympic athletes? You know, it's crazy. I mean, Ariel just kind of got really into snowboarding the past few years. So I think when we were growing up, it was more like me trying to go and just like be at the top level. And then, you know, she saw how cool it was and decided that she wanted to really be a part of it. So, I mean, it's amazing that we're both going. So at your guys' house, you probably have cases of Monster and Red Bull. Do you ever drink a Red Bull by accident? That hasn't happened yet. <laughs> have you ever seen her secretly drink a Monster? Not to date, but I'm going to try to get a picture. Congratulations. <laughs> All right, so it's official. You're a four-time Olympic athlete. Yeah, it's pretty wild. I never, um, I never planned it out that I'd be going to my fourth Olympic team when I was 30. That is so cool. Yeah, it's just an absolute privilege. You know, I think uh, it never gets old. It mm -hmm. never gets less special. How did the coat feel? Um, Co was good. I uh, I had only seen them in photos, so it was cool yeah. to check them out. They look better in person. I agree. Yeah, I think so they did better. a good job with them, and uh, yeah, stoked that I get to call one my own. Sweet. Well, will we see you at X Games? I forget. Yeah. We yeah. Will, yeah. Right? All right, I go there tomorrow. We'll see you in Aspen. Hey. Congratulations. Thank you very much. All right, Sean, you made the team. Yeah, I was gonna say it's really hot in this room, so you must be pretty hot in that thing. But uh. It's good fit, man. Just yeah. wanted to stand yeah. out, you know. Just you so you had to made feel it. For both. You're the only one that made both. Um, How long has this road been on the slope saw battle? It's been a mission. I mean, I, I felt pretty confident about the half pipe, yep. but uh, catching up. I mean, I, I had just learned all the doubles by the time I needed to learn triples, so I didn't really get to cement them in the in the book of tricks I got. But um, I'm happy. I mean, I, I still feel like I got a long road ahead. So yeah. I mean, this is fun and all, but I'm I'm still in the hunt. Yeah, so it's not over yet. yeah, it's not you over. You think we're gonna see triples in Russia? Uh, of course, yeah. Which which one? A secret one that we haven't seen yet. Oh, you're talking pipe or slope? Either. Oh man, we'll have to see. <laughs> all right, cool. Cheers. Thanks,